Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 9 of the Adobe InDesign tutorial series and whenever you're designing in Adobe InDesign you really have to copy and paste some of the designs especially when you're designing a magazine or a book. So we might design something like headers and footers. So uh, copying them all across the pages is too much of a hassle. So InDesign provides a solution for that. So let's say you have multiple pages over here and then now what I want to do is I want to have a header and a footer. So what you can do is you can use something called a master page over here. So over here you can see something called a master. So just double click on the a master and you can see that you have been taken on to a new page. So now what I can do is I can take um, an object right here. For example, I take the rectangular tool over here and I'm simply going to draw a rectangular tool just like this. And now over here I'm going to fill this up with a color over here. I'm going to alt and drag, alt click and drag, so that will copy out the header over there. Uh, so that is going to be the header uh, for both of my pieces. And on the footer side, I'm going to click and drag one icon over here, just like this. And then put, uh, uh, put it with a color, just like this. Alt click and drag, and there you go. That is how you manage the footer of the piece. So you can uh, write down something as a text over here as well. So just click and drag over here, and that writes down the text just like this and this is going to be header one. So just select the text and then change its color to something like paper over here and click and drag and there you go. So I'm just going to keep it out right here and then I'm going to uh, select the header out. Uh, so this is going to be header two and I'm, I'm going to align it to the right. So that's how you can set the masterpiece. So if I were to go back, you can see that now all of the pages actually have the header one and two. So now this is actually a part of all the pages. So if you were to create a new page right here, you can see that it is a part of the new page as well. But usually uh, sometimes you do not want to include a master page in some of the pages. For example, on the title page, maybe you want to add in a cover here. So what you can do is you can go to this section right here and now I'm going to right click this and I'm going to select no master. So I'm going to go to uh, Go apply master to pages. So I'm going to select this, apply master to pages and over here I'm going to select none and press OK. And you can see that that removes the master page from that section. And sometimes you want uh, another type of master. Let's say for example these four sections are special uh, content. So what you can do is you can right click over here and go to uh, click on new master and then you can see that you have B master. You can name it anything you want. For example, I'm going to rename it to tutu tube. All right, to the tube TUT, uh, so name will be mass TUT and I'm going to do uh, OK and that will create another mass, TUT mass uh, master page right here. So what I can do is I can simply draw out anything that I want over here, just select it out, select a color just like this, black, all right, and then click and drag just like this and there you go, that's the master page over there. So now what we can do is this is the TUT master page, so go back over here. And from the section right here, from uh, these four sections, uh, let's say these four sections, I'm going to right click, I'm going to say master pay, apply master to pages, and then I'm going to select TUT mass. And you can see that four of the master pages actually has TUT applied to it. And you can see that the, it has been applied right from over here. So that is how you apply TUT master page in four of the pages. So that is how you can apply, insert, uh, master pages inside of Adobe InDesign. Hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.